You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! Alright, yo, uh, 15 Minutes of Fame, man, I'm back with DNA, man. Yeah. Um, we were uh, one week away, you and Real Sick. Yeah. Um, I, I, I dropped a, um, a joint with uh, Easy to Block Captain and K Sean when we was in Atlanta. And it was just ironic, man, that in that interview, you was like, yeah, you take Easy and I'll take Real Sick on the same card. I know. I know. <laughs> yo, real, yo, Uncle Rod, niggas know, man. I put, I put that shit together, man. That's crazy. Yo, I was like, wow. Yo, you know, you know we got to stop saying that, though. It's not that. And, and, and it was not in talks because Sean and Easy was far fetched at that time. Neither one of those. But you know, yeah, you, you yeah. know what? You know what the, was powerful. Why well, I tell niggas this all the time? You speak what you want into existence. Mm -hmm. It was spoken into existence. Just because the world they see it, it was sitting in your camera. Spoken into existence. Look how the stars align. It's here, man. And yeah, uh, like I say, a week away, man. And uh, you got real sick. Yeah. On the volume card. This is volume nine. Nine. Okay. I don't know why eight keeps popping in my head. Because it just happened. The yeah. First time they really did it back to back. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So you got them. I got them. You know. You you always get who you want. You know. I mean, as I should. I'm yeah. <laughs> Eventually, you know, uh, it it comes around. Um. Real sick. Uh. Real sick versus past day. Who won? Past day. Two one. Two one. Yeah, I'm, and I'm not. I'm not just saying that because right. it's my next opponent. Real sick, did good, debatable battle, no clear winner. But um, you know, just being a little all around, go with past day. Okay. I mean, real can sick that was good though. Can, can that real sick beat DNA on the 18th on volume? No. Nah. No. Mm -hmm. No. No. Mm -hmm. Why? So he has to be better than that Me? to stand in there with you. Listen, man. I'm not gonna tell him what he needs to do. He gonna do what he does. What he does, people love it. You know what I mean? I'm just do it. I just wanna do what I do. Yeah. And and I, I, did you call him out or? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why yeah. real sick? Why like why was he you know on your radar? It's not really nothing. It never has nothing to do with real sick. It's like almost like I'm a hater. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm a hater. You didn't hate it? Yeah. You didn't like that he was doing his thing? That's how I became the PG killer, by being a hater. Okay, okay, okay. Somebody knew was on my block, they getting a lot of love, people was, you know what I mean? Nah, man, I don't like that shit. Okay, okay. I'm a hater. Nah, I'm joking, but a lot a lot, of, a lot of people was just saying that, you know what I mean? He's, he's next up, he's receiving a lot of love, he's getting better, he's getting good, and then, you know, because I started that, um... That PG killer shit, as soon as somebody new starts going, they, they always throw them in that direction. So I started getting wind of it, and man, it don't take too long for me to get activated. So, you know what I mean? Let's get activated. We active. We here. I said, let's do it. And then, um, and then you know, URL, they ain't feel like he was ready, so it ain't happening. It is, is that, uh, are you quoting they didn't think he was ready, or you no, just I'm assuming? Right. Uncle Rob, whenever I ever been a nigga that assumed, man. I've never been that type of guy. I've been around for a long time. One thing niggas know with me, my word is mine. Nah, I'm not assuming that. I told real sick that. We were supposed to battle on Summer Madness. Oh, what? Okay. Yeah. I wanted to do it on Civil War, too. They, uh, by the time the Drake card happened, I think they offered it, but, um, nah, it didn't happen. And then I had King Lose, so we in now. Do you think he's ready to stand in front of DNA? As ready as he's gonna be, yeah. No, I'm just curious as to the time when they didn't think he was, you know, from that time I mean, to I, now. You know why I don't go for that? Because like, I'm, 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 a, I'm a tactician, so I got put in situations where I wasn't ready to be there, but I, I got ready, I found out how to get ready. So I can't tell nobody what they are because you know what I mean? I've been nervous. I was nervous. The most nervous I've probably ever been for a battle was before Ill Will. Mm. That's top three DNA performances. If you ask me before we got on, I wasn't ready. I was second guessing everything. I was nervous. I was panicking. All of that shit. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Nervous about this one? Nah. Not at all? Okay. I, I said back in, the back in my career, I used to be easily influenced by what people would say. Like, it would get to me reading comments or people saying that that shit doesn't phase me no more like i it's, it's like a certain zone you hit just in life in life there's like no 
Yeah, just in general. Not, I don't argue as much as I used to before. I don't get mad like that no more because what you gotta say is your perspective and then it's whatever I want my reality to be. This is mine. This is, this is my life. I control my destiny. I control everything that's about to happen. So, nah, it's nothing to be nervous about. Excited? Yeah. Because, you know what I mean? This is a battle people been wanting to see for a while. I still got just as much hunger for this shit as when I started. So, I'm still learning. That's that's why I tell niggas every time it's dangerous. When I'm, I'm here 12 plus years and I'm still willing to learn every single time. That's why it gets... Better and better. Cause I'm still willing I mean, to take still people on the come up. Not yet, yeah, that too, but like just willing to pay attention. Because you it's always a mistake there. The question is, are you gonna see the mistake? Are you gonna adjust to the mistake? And then are you gonna bounce back? Are you gonna be so egotistical and into yourself that you feel like you got everything down pat? Never feel that way. So I'm excited. You know what I mean? Now you're an all-around battle rapper. You've been in every probably every situation and you've created your own situations in battle rap to battle mm -hmm. you know um real sick really started to blow up in that small room on the caffeine uh people didn't think a lot of those guys was gonna do well once the covid slowed down and the stages opened back up um he did great on civil war versus ab then he turns around and do another big stage with uh with pat stay um that narrative is is dead now you know he can rap on stage or in a small room this one is it small room or is it in between small room and stage it's in between okay it's not 20 people but it's not 2000 I, from what i heard capacity we might cap at 250 right still a rapping room still a room where you know what i mean but but you still gotta you know what i mean does I, that make a difference for you whether it was on a big stage or a small nah no nah it was more like when I said I wanted to battle him, preferably, I wanted to battle him in like the room that when COVID first hit. Okay. When nobody did, because I, I look at him as a rapper's rapper. So I wanted to, you know what I mean, get activated on that mode. But, um, you know what I mean, everybody said like that wouldn't be the test. So they wanted it to be on the big stage. Like it's so crazy. The culture creates narratives and then they throw it on people. I never, I never tell none of these niggas what they can and can't do, nigga. Who the fuck am I? I just be saying what, what, what the coach would be saying. I mean, so I, I like battling people in their comfort zone. So at that time, that was his comfort zone. Now, I don't think it matters. So I'm cool with 250. I'm cool with two. I mean, me and him going battle. Not everybody else there is just watching. That's a fact. All right, yeah, that's uh, um, December 18th, December 18th, man, 6 volume. p.m. Eastern time. Caffeine for free. Make sure you tune in. Easy to block versus Kayshawn. New Jersey twerk versus Surf. Charlie Clips vs. B Dot, Casey J vs. Vixen, Shotgun Shook vs. Real Name Brandon. Been doing this shit so long, I know, I know he's. Let's go, man. Fifteen minutes of fame. You are now listening to Fifteen Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go.